Hello everyone, welcome to another little gas mask review. They said gas mask meme review, even though I don't do those yet. Um, I don't know why I've got this set up with a flashlight, it actually looks quite heinous. But uh, I'm sure you can see what we're reviewing anyway. Alright, there we go. Um, I feel as though that lighting is still quite bad. No torch. Help someone out, will you? Thank you. Lovely. I'll just set that up over here. No, that's bad. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to another little gas mask review. This one's going to be a very short one because I'm having to hold up the lighting with my fucking hand because my recent normal bulb fucking broke. I had to get another, and so the lighting in here is, um. Yeah, it's not good. So, here we've got a lovely condition. GM54. I'm actually gonna turn this off. You've got eyes and you've got brightness settings. Uh, like I said, this is gonna be a really short review because I've made them all too long in the past and I've not got a lot of time. So, this is the GM54. It's a German made mask from the post war that was made, of course, in 1954. This particular model is from 1961, right before it was replaced by the M62. Uh, this one is in the best condition I've ever seen one of these in, as in it's still uh, supple. If you actually go and watch like Weapons and Stuff 93s, GM54, or even... Um... Who's that new fucking Life of Boris wannabe? That guy, he's his is shagged as well. This one's in near mint con, the only thing letting it down is some cracks here on the nose. Um, this one is a size 3, which is actually why I'm selling it, and which is why I'm in a rush, because I've actually got to post it today. You can focus. There we go. Uh, this is, of course, 40 mi 40 millimeter. Uh, it'll probably be called Stalag. I'm guessing. I'm not sure what the filters are about, but they are full of asbestos. There's not much to say about this mask. It is that simple German design that they've had since the 1930s. It's a GM30 clone that they've had for years. This is a little pull tab because it would be held in a tin. A tin I don't have. Size 3 is small, size 2 is medium, size 1 is large. Since this is size 3, I'm also compelled to sell it. I love the uh, metal intake outtake ports here. Now, the elastic on this is actually still intact. With a lovely three buckle head strap and then one around here that would be your neck. And you whip that around, around your neck, and you pop it on like so like uh, the 1970s Hungarian masks. Inside, if I flip this around, we can have a look. It's a very simple design. This one is made by Auer. Or Auer. Huawei. Uh, it's got a chin strap here that can be adjusted. A chin strap, a little chin hold thing, which is pretty good for the time. No anti-fogging whatsoever. Uh, there is a little interesting tidbit about these, which is that, uh, also here's your uh, inhale, there's your exhale. And of course this has a uh, furry, almost leather, peripheral seal. Uh, the interesting history about these, because I've got, I'm on my last 30 seconds, before I have to stop recording because I've literally got to go. Uh, it's also got the person's name on it there. It's the car. I can't read that. Um, time's ticking, I haven't, okay, I'm going to sacrifice my 30 seconds. Alright, there we go. Um, what's interesting about these is that these were actually made from, if I remember correctly, recycled bandages, stockinette, that kind of thing. But they're then coated in rubber. Which is, of course, quite interesting, and also is why that they perish so easily, they can melt, crack, dry out. They get damaged very easily. It's a shame, because they're very interesting masks, even if they do smell a bit weird. So, there you go, there's your history for them. They're post-war German. Very cool designs, I love them. Uh, very hard to find them in this condition, so I do hope that the buyer enjoys it. Thank you very much, I hope you enjoyed this quicker gas mask review. I don't like it. I wish I had more time, but I don't. GM54, amazing floppy floppy condition, size 3 small. Hope you enjoyed. Hope you like that cardboard box you can see in the corner too.